Question number one is all about crisps. It says a box of crisps contains three different flavours. So on the side of the box you can see we've got prawn cocktail, cheese and onion, salt and vinegar. It says a quarter of the packets are prawn cocktail flavour. Prawn cocktail we'll call PC for short. The probability of picking cheese and onion is 30% or cheese and onion we'll call C and O for short. It says, what is the probability of picking salt and vinegar? Salt and vinegar we'll call S and V for short. Well, let's have a look what we've got so far. Well, prawn cocktail, we already know is a quarter. But this one is in a percentage. Cheese and onions in a percentage, prawn cocktails in a fraction. So let's turn everything into percentages. So a quarter is the same as 25%. So prawn cocktail is the same as 25%. Cheese and onion, we already know from the question, is 30%. So let's see what that gives us so far. If we add those together, 5 and nothing is 5, 2 and 3 is 5. So, so far we've got 55%. Now, salt and vinegar must be all the rest that will make it add up to 100%. So the question is, what do we need to add on to 55% to get it up to 100% because the total needs to be 100%. Well, salt and vinegar then, to get from 55 up to 100, if you add on 5, you'll get to 60% and then you'll need another 40 to get from 60% up to 100, so it's going to be 45%. So in your answer in here, you can write several ways of writing 45%. You could write 45% or you could write 0.45 or you could even write 45 out of 100. These are all ways of saying 45% as a percentage, a decimal or a fraction. There's one other answer you could give and you could even simplify this 45 out of 100. If you divide both the numerator and the denominator by 5, 5's into 45 would go 9, and 5's into 100 would go 20. So you could have any of these answers would be acceptable.